Hey there, so in this tutorial I'm going to show you how you can have a private messaging system inside your WordPress system. So first thing you have to do is log into your WordPress backend. Once you get inside, you will have to navigate to plugins. Here, you are going to click on add new plugin. And then you're going to search for front and PA. This is the plugin that is going to allow us to have internal private messaging system within WordPress. So here is the plugin with name front end PM. Click on install now. Click on activate plugin so that you can access the settings and features. Okay, so here you will find front end PM added inside the dashboard. So click on settings. here you will find that it has setting related to how many messages per user is allowed keeping it to 50 limits the inbox capacity how many pages to show default is 15 then how many pages per directory is set to 50 then time delay between messages is 5 seconds so if you set to zero it will have no delay okay so there is also username blocking features so you can add multiple user like let's say this and another this likewise you can type the name and separate by comma and block those user from comma sending private message to each other then you have custom CSS that you can use for your private messaging system okay then you have editor type which is WP editor teeny or WP editor default then here is option for attachment you can allow or disallow by default it doesn't allow there is also email that you can send as an announcement to every user there is hide directory from front end and hide auto suggestion disable sending new message and hiding for footer and header okay these are the settings now let's look at instructions okay. here you can create a page for front end pm Give it a title. Let's give it a title something like private messaging. For that, let's first create a page. Give it a name inbox and then paste this HTML on your page and publish it. So we given the instruction exactly the way they asked us to. Now let's go to view this page. Here we can
check here the inbox. It says welcome hash, you answer messages, your announcement, etc. Now let's click on new message. So it presents us with two subjects, let's say happen, which is not available in our user directory. So it will show us no it is found, subject as happy birthday. Then message, hi, happy birthday. And you can just send the message. So make sure that you have user here so that it will automatically search for you and send it you can also send an announcement if you are admin to all the users within your system currently it is empty so you can add new so this is add new announcement similar to our mail system where you can add the subject send the message and it will reach to all the users you can also use files as attachment within your announcement then you have message box where you can check each message that you get and then setting okay so here you find that what you want to reference how the users to send me a message take yes then email me when I get a message, no. Then email me when new announcement is published, no. And save these options. Okay, now let's see what directory means. As you can see direct, for directory, you will find number of users available. You can hide this one from non-users so that there won't be any spam. Then you have all messages, where messages from your team will be shown here just like message box just goes with personal messages sorted so this is how pretty much front end private messaging works it is very simple to use and it doesn't have much resources on your system so if you are in search of a good private messaging system then this is the plugin to go for and they do have a paid support as well so if you are deploying this on any commercial project then this plugin is very handy so i hope you find this tutorial helpful if you have any questions comments do let me know on my channel and thanks for watching